Hey folks and fans, you're blind dyslexic here. Heading off for work. I've been working on the old webs page. I finally figured that stuff out. So, so there's the new blind dyslexic blog page. That Wix thing. That Wix page, I don't know if it's my computer or the site, but it just slowed my computer up something fierce. So, I don't know what's going on, so I'm using webs, and I'll put a uh, link down below on, for you to check that out. And it's going to have pretty much the same, about the same amount of stuff that, that the old one did. And I'm going to try to keep up to date with it. But, like I said with, uh, on one page, uh, the King Hawaiian pork sandwich will be returning in August. Which, I'm psyched about, I love that sandwich. That's what I call the crack sandwich. That is definitely a crack sandwich. So as soon as the crack sandwich returns, you know I will be. Other things I've added is uh, links to the Vaughn stations that I listen to. I haven't yet gotten Area 151 up yet. That little uh, th that little deal with Sammy B and uh, Al. But I do have Rains and I do have Diamonds. So just go to the link down below and you'll be a and whatever day they're on, you'll be able to catch them. But the last hour, hour and a half of rain. Uh, but, but no, I've pretty much been trying to work on that page, and it's been a lot easier. Only trouble I was having was it seems like when I wanted to colorize a word, from time to time I have to do like two words or three words at a time because it didn't want to. That's the only problem I was having. Otherwise, oh, and that and the uh, couple of the pictures I used in the uh, TBD news section, they wouldn't be published. But I finally got that evolved. That evolved. I got that resolved. So I'm happy about that. Oh, but I gotta close tonight. Uh, I would who I would have brought my QT sandwich, but I had to eat it. I'm sorry. I I sat there. I was working on my on my page, and it's like, what the hell? I'll do it. And I, I I left the chips behind. The chips I did leave behind because I can munch on those at any time. Uh, but pretty much the web's page is set up the same way. Hello. Did you need to come in? No. Oh, okay. I'm just waiting for my daughter. Alrighty. That sounds like a beautiful get together. You were here to witness it. But. But no, the page is pretty much set up the same way. Uh, the the news function. I want to try to do it as a commentary thing, but so far everything is on all the pages. Uh, yeah. But I do want to say, give a shout out to that little gal who's, and father who stood outside. I should say more across the street at. Uh, Selling pink lemonade across the 
street from uh, Westboro Baptist Church. Kudos to you too. Kudos. And I forget how, I forget how much money they they raised, but kudos to those to that little girl. And Westboro Baptist Church, this is for you. The fact that you would do that to that little girl proves to me that your tax exempt status should be revoked. And for anybody who's watching this who agree, please give a thumbs up or a comment down below. across the street here. Oh. Let this car pass, he's just determined to go by. We going to see you can't tell these people you can't tell if they're gonna turn or what they're gonna do half the time. I'm glad I hesitated. Dude was all over on that one lane like he was going to turn and never did. That happened before uh, when I was coming from, uh, I was going from Twins. They were over on the side that looked like they were going to turn into that shopping center there. So I started to cross and of course the driver got a little bit hacked. But did I care? No. Uh, yeah, but out there too, pretty much on right on that street, that spot there, about a few years ago, I was heading to work, and a car must have been going about 90. I go about I'm going to say 90, 80 to 90, coming from that direction. I was just when they were at uh, Baker Street. Another car was pulling out of that little spot there and just got ramrodded, T-boned on top of the median there. I'll still, I'll never forget that. I'd love to find out what the story behind that was, but never did. Pardon me. Yeah, I was watching uh, AMC Theater, AMC, uh, then talking about uh, Superman 2 and all that, uh, uh, Man of Steel 2 and all that, and they were saying that even though it's good, but with Monsters University and World War Z coming out next week, being number one might... Might not be still number one. I'm thinking Man of Steel will probably be if number two, then number three. Because I'm gonna say Z. I'm gonna make a prediction stating that World War Z and Monsters University, it will be close. Maybe a hundred. Maybe 100 to 200, 100 to 150 close. I definitely have to get something to drink. I still got 45 minutes before I've got to be at that lovely site and close. Uh, we got a lot of stuff to take care of because apparently the head show is coming sometime this week. Pretty funny, but and so far, uh, all the times he's been here, I've had to close, so I've had to miss him. 
I wonder if they're trying to keep me from being seen. No. I ran into the head honcho at least twice. Twice, and I said hey to him. Uh, but either way, no big thing if I see him. But I'm heading off in that way. Yeah, they moved our uh, open top the other day, so that's center. So, that one off to one side, the screwed up door, will be our main door. Uh. <sighs> then I guess, since I can't think of anything else to say, I'm just babbling on. Say east.